Welcome back to the house. So listen, we got to go ahead and talk celebrity big brother. You guys, I am pissed because how dumb can Carson and Cynthia be like? Just idiots. Um, Carson wants to backdoor Shayna. Idiot. Okay. When Misha and Todrick have been gunning and targeting you the whole entire game, you try to get out Shayna who took you off the block stupid like stupid 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 like are you an idiot or are you an idiot y'all deserve to go home okay i was rooting for cynthia but it's just like where is the logic okay where is the logic at the very end of the day forget who's been shady forget who's been lying forget who has an alliance with whom y'all know that y'all cannot beat Shayna, or excuse me y'all cannot beat misha in any of these competitions why would you not get her out you can't be her in the competitions and she's on record of trying to target you since the very beginning. Why wouldn't you get her out? It's just the stupidity of it all. Obviously, Todrick and Misha were enemy, you know, public enemy number one and two. They were doing and saying anything to get you to shift your target from them to Shayna and it worked. Like, I feel like I'm getting dumber just watching this uh, damn show. So, yeah, Carson wants to backdoor Shayna, idiot, because I guess Shayna was trying to play both sides. Okay. Okay, Carson. Okay. Um, the fillers is going to your brain. Okay. Cynthia, your wig is squeezing your brain too tight. Them braids are squeezing your scalp too tight. No, Cynthia is mad at Shayna uh, because Shayna's trying to stay in the house. Cynthia obviously doesn't know how to play Big Brother. The point of the game is to stay in the house. Duh, like Cynthia. If I only had a brain. Okay, Scarecrow. Teresa, Real Housewives of, uh, Ultimate Girl Trip. Yeah, you the Scarecrow, uh, sis. Uh, Misha, of course, if she stays in the house, her plan is to backdoor Carson next week if she gets a chance to win HOH. And I hope they do it. I really hope that they get Carson or Cynthia out. I think they're idiots. Um, Lamar is in the house. He's talking about Chloe. He regrets hurting her. We don't care. And then what was up with Lamar in uh, the eviction tonight? Um, you know, just being so gross. Okay. Chewing up the skin on his fingers, biting his fingernails, spitting it out his mouth, putting it on the couch. I'm like, this is like the reincarnation of it from I Love Money. If you know what the hell I'm talking about, comment it down below. Lamar is special. And I don't know if he's acting... I think he's acting. Ain't no way. Ain't no damn. Well, maybe he's not. He probably is like, you know what? CBS approached me. They, they're giving me a nice check. I might as well just go in his house and just act a damn fool. Like, I'm convinced. Anyways. um, So, yeah. Lamar's talking about Chloe. Cynthia actually encourages him to reach out to Chloe when they get out. Like, Cynthia, girl, you know nothing about relationships. Uh, Your first marriage fell uh, the relationship with the uh girl's father fell um you know the current relationship the man was just talking about how he uh was thinking about getting a divorce like sis i really hope you go home next week i really do um moving right along todrick ends up winning the veto i don't even know what the dumbass veto was these competitions like i always say are so silly and stupid cbs big brother needs to do a better job at these damn competitions uh todrick ends up winning the veto what i did not expect was him taking down todd and for a second I, i'm still not quite sure why he did that I, I don't know why he didn't take down misha because it was misha and todd bridges up on the block but he ended up taking down Todd instead of his girl Misha and at first I was thinking okay maybe it's because this is a whole grand scheme we've all just been punked and everybody came together to create this whole fake storyline and narrative to really just get out Misha the whole time but that was just wishful thinking I was being too optimistic at the situation I don't know why he did that I don't know why he did that um you know but he took down Todd. If I was Carson, I would have put up Lamar. Therefore, people would have had no choice but to get out Misha. But you know that Carson is an idiot. So Carson ended up putting up Shayna as a replacement nominee. Like I said, everybody voted to evict. Lamar was taken forever. And by the end of the episode, Shayna was evicted. 
Cynthia and Carson, count your days, count your days, count your days. I mean, talk about one of the worst Big Brother moves of all time. Talk about some of the worst players in Big Brother. If Cynthia and Carson actually escape, um, I don't think they can escape it because Lamar and Todd seem to be more on Misha and Todrick's side than anything else. So I don't know. They don't have the numbers, so I'm not sure what's going to happen unless everybody just starts getting a brain and stop being a damn scarecrow. I really don't see them making it too far. Maybe they will, but I really don't see it. With everybody having this follower, you know, kissing ass mentality, you know, they get rid of people that save them. Like, it's just dumb. It's really just dumb. And as a Big Brother fan, I'm highly disappointed in this season. And I believe that one of the reasons why this season has been so freaking trash is because nobody knows how to play the game but Misha and goddamn Todrick. That's why they're winning. They're the only people that know what they're doing. They're the only people that understand the concept of Big Brother. Just go on Paramount Plus any random night and just watch them and, you know, listen to their conversations. You can clearly tell that Todd Bridges don't know what the hell going on. Uh, Cynthia Bailey doesn't know how to play Big Brother. Uh, Lamar obviously is playing dumb. And Carson kind of knows what he's doing, but he's so easily manipulated. It's just mind-boggling to me nobody knows what they're doing so of course the only woman that knows how to play big brother is going to win the damn game misha so anyways y'all gotta let me know how y'all feel about the situation i'm gonna go ahead and log off i love you guys and don't forget to create a great day